Let's find the slope of this curve at x equals 1. We just take two points and find the change in y divided by the change in x, delta y over delta x. So let's try 0.13 and 418. This would give us delta y over delta x, 15 over 3, which is 5. That means if you go across one unit from x equals 1, you'll go up 5 units in the y direction. We've got 2, 6 as our next coordinate, one unit across, not 2, 8. So let's try a closer point to 1, 3. That would take us closer because if we went across 1, we'd go up 4 to 2. 2, 7, but it's still not right. An idea is to think about a very close point, x equal to 1 plus h. So the function value at x equals 1 plus h, and we get 1 plus h all squared plus 2. So now our gradient, if we end up with 2 plus h as our result, consider what happens as our second point gets closer and closer to the one we're interested in finding the slope at. This is what's called taking the limit as h approaches 0. So that limit is just going to be 2 because h will keep getting smaller and approaching 0. This means that we're going to take the slope of y at x equals 1 to be equal to 2.